Hey everybody, welcome back to Omori. Or should I say Sunny in this case, because we're in what looks like the white space as Sunny. Everyone has made up, they've come to terms with what's happened to Mari. But Basil has locked himself in his room and from what we can see, his grandmother has passed away. And I'm a little bit worried that he keeps saying, can you please forgive me, my best friend. It makes me think he's done something, like he's been under a lot of stress from, you know. Mari dying, his grandmother dying, Aubrey like bullying him. And like he hasn't been dealing with it well. Like he scrubbed out the pictures in his photo album. We found out that Aubrey fixed it. So I'm really worried where this is going. But let's march through the white space. Just before I talk to you, Amori. Destroy the light bulb? I didn't even speak to Amari. Bold play! <laughs> I didn't even think that was so weird. I just immediately clicked yes. Hello. Can we finally figure out what you are? Are you Basil? Something. Something drags Sunny into the shadows. Sunny takes 29 damage. Sunny attacks something, it did nothing. Calm down. Think things through. Recovers 40 heart. It keeps dragging me into the shadows. We just stay calm. Something taunts on as he falls. Stay calm. Sunny calms down and recovers 40 hearts. Can we... Can we run? Nope. Calm down has been pretty good for me so far. We recover health. Are you going to keep dragging me into the shadows? Yes, you are. You take 28 more damage. Listen, I can do this all day if you want to something. Maybe we're meant to hit the other phase. Maybe we're not. Because you are now different. So we are progressing the fight in some means. We'll calm. Interesting that I had focus an option there, but not actually. It was greyed out. Right, you're biting me. No. Let's focus. I've got focus as an option now. Well, can I actually hurt you now? We get dragged into the shadows one more time. It did nothing. Well, that's not the answer then. We recover 40 heart. You keep dragging me into the shadows. I presume I'm going to keep unlocking new skills and then maybe we legitimately fight. This is the water thing. Persist is now an option. I would recover 40 heart. Heart cannot reach zero for one turn. Let's do it. We persist. I don't even see what we're fighting anymore. It's something still. Calm down, we're still afraid. Focus.
Something swi- You feel like your life is in danger. Persist. Sonny persists. We took 143 damage, our lungs tighten up. Persist. We keep persisting. Take 17 damage, your heart beats out of your chest. I don't think we ever attack here. This could be a huge misplay. We could be getting bad ending, but I think we persist through. This is the image of Mari, isn't it? We must have found her. Your fingers won't stop trembling. Come on, Sonny. You hear your breathing begin to steady. Calm down. You hear your heart begin to steady. Stay calm. I'm not attacking you. You gather all your courage and learn to overcome. I didn't even read what he did. I just clicked it. That was pretty unsettling for me. Got a light bulb. Fine. Oh, it's Basil. Just in case. Anything hiding back here? No. Sonny, you're finally here. Please don't ask me to, like, take you out of here and rescue you. I've always dreamed that you would come back for me. But maybe it's too late. The truth of that day will be hard to accept. When you see it, you have to stay strong. And if you can, please forgive me. You got Basil's photo album. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I'm not happy. Oh, I'm so unhappy. Well, it's telling me where they go again. Oh my god. Basil, I think it's Mori by the window. Oh my god, I can explore the house. Hospital, okay. Did we make it look like suicide? Did we kill her? Was I right? Like, ages back? Okay, let's explore the left side. Okay, there's another photo. I'm not sure what this is. 
Like, the person who's, like, on the bottom, I can't see. What the fuck was that? The door is locked. Eh. Uh, does that mean there's a picture I've missed? You see four kids playing in the forest. You see four kids talking to a giant statue. You see four kids riding a minecart. Oh, they're playing Minecraft. You see three kids and one toast. That's unsettling. You see four kids climbing a ladder to space. You see five kids having a picnic. You see four kids riding an elevator. And you see four kids talking to a whale. Wait. Are we in the hospital? Is this the dream world? I'm so confused. Like, I'm gripped right now by the story. I can't help but think there is a picture in here somewhere though. Oh my god, I've just seen it. The door is still locked. Why is the drip unplugged? Well. What if I don't want to go down the stairs? What if I want to go through the doors to my left and right? I will pick up the picture first. What's the actual... Are these doors locked? Door is locked. I have to check them all. Door is locked. Striked. Okay. Down the stairs we go. Push it down the stairs. Sonny, don't worry. Everything's going to be okay. This person is not breathing. Why are you not letting me put the photos in anymore? Something is preventing you from getting closer. <sighs> right, we have to find the pictures. <laughs> what the fuck? We did this, didn't we? We set it up as a suicide, we pushed it down the stairs. But why though? Why are we smiling? <laughs> what the fuck? Like... <laughs> Fighting. What? I can't get away from it. It's faster than me. Never! Okay.
Do you want to screw the light bulb in? No, but... It was us all along. Again, I should really be like looking at the the pictures for the orders right now. Uh, yeah, I think you'll appreciate why I've gone a bit somber right now. I did not expect this turn. No, there's still more pictures. We're not done. I'm gonna guess Basil helped me. He saw what happened. And we're best friends, so he helped me. Like, look at us right now. So this is why we've gone silent. And why we stayed away from everyone. And why Basil tried to stay away from everyone. Because we knew the truth. There's the toy box we have the key for. It's going to tell me the reason why we did this, isn't it? Has to have some relation to the music practice. Is it going to be like a violin or something? I'm not sure. Because we were meant to have the recital. Why would we be having a fight when we were meant to be doing a recital? That's what the eye is. It's that the eye between her hair. That's what that thing's been all this time. We're gonna save you, Basil. There's no fault at Basil here. I mean, they're just children. 
There's no fault really anywhere. A terrible accident has happened. And being children didn't know how to deal with it. Ah, Sunny, it's just you. I'm glad you came. It's, it's so good to see you. It came to you that day, the day Mari died. When Mari, when Mari fell, you, you couldn't have done it. It was something behind you, wasn't it? You're a good person, Sonny. I know you're a good person. A good person wouldn't do something like that. After all this time, you finally come back for me. But tomorrow, you're going away. How could you do that? That's mean, Sonny. That's so mean. Ah. Uh. There's something all around us now. Can you see it, Sonny? There's no way out of this, is there? Where are you going? Stop trying to leave me. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. I don't want to be alone. Not again. You can't leave me again. No. You wouldn't leave me. That's not like you, Sonny. It's something behind you again, isn't it? Ah, there it is now. Do you see it? Stay away. Stay away from Sonny. I'll protect you no matter what, Sonny. You can count on me. When something killed Mari, when something ruined all my photos, I didn't say anything. I didn't want people to think it was you, Sonny. Sonny. Sonny wouldn't do something like that. Don't worry, Sonny. I'll save you again. Something behind you. I'll get rid of it once and for all. Sonny, don't be scared. I'm scared too, but this is for the best. Everything is going to be okay. Everything is going to be okay. Okay? Eh. Uh, we, we don't fight you. We're here to save you. I want to see what you're going to do. So I'm going to persist. I probably shouldn't have done that first, though. I think I should have gone calm. You tried to persist, but you couldn't hold steady. You want to run. We don't run. We don't fight either, you muppet. We stay calm. We remove afraid. You tried to calm down, but your lungs fought to breathe. Basil reached inside, Sonny. We don't run. We focus. Sonny. There's no way out of this, is there? I mean, based on the fact that I can see my ult bar, I think there is a way out of this. And it's just to keep taking damage. We tried to focus, but nausea overwhelmed you. Right, they reach inside of me again? We're not running. No. We have no skills left? 
I'd rather attack than run. This might be the bad ending. If we run away now, we're leaving Basil. Tell me, Sonny. Am I selfish for doing this? Basil takes 18 damage. And then just sticks to us. You want to run. There's no skills left. We just attack. Yeah, we're not going to kill you. We're gonna get the ult. Sunny, do you hate me? They take 14 damage. We take five. You want to run. For all I know, we could do the big wombo combo and murder them, but I don't think that's gonna be what happens. Please, stop it. All right, they take 17 damage. We keep taking six, that's fine. I want to run. We're not running though. In one more turn we get our ult. Stop struggling, Sonny. I'm... I'm so tired. Battle takes 15. We take eight. And now we get our ult, right? You want to run. Everything is gonna be okay. That's what the ult was. Stressed out. Eh. Uh, maybe it'll let me ult. Basil takes 20 damage. Okay, I'm not sure I'm doing right anymore. Maybe it should be run. No, I think this is right. I think running is the bad ending. We, we overcome together. That being said, I think he's going to murder me. Oh, we're going to murder you. One of the two. We can only take two more hits. But I think Basil can only take two more hits and we're faster. Well, let's hope this is right. Why? Why won't you stop? Everything is going to be okay. This doesn't sound like the good ending. have to go straight back. I'm a bit worried that I'm allowed to walk in the road right now. Eh. Uh, hmm. Hmm. The days sure are changing quickly. Nope, not interact with you. Where are we going? I'm just looping around. Oh. We wanted to go up, apparently. Your acknowledgement of the truth has come at a great cost. But it is not too late for your redemption. Fortunately, you still know the way back home. Okay. I 
I'm going back to my home. Hello, Mew. We will not cut you open, Mew. Don't worry. Just follow the cat. Hi, Sonny. You found your way back home. I don't know if I've ever said this properly, but I'm sorry for causing you so much trouble. When I gave you my photo album, I really did want you to have it. But somehow, whenever I tried to help, I always end up burdening you instead. Even back then. All this pain we've been feeling. The guilt in our hearts. Even if you try to bottle it all up, it all comes out somehow. I want to say that everything will be okay. That we'll have no choice but to carry on. But, that's up to you. Aubrey, Kel, and Hero are all good friends. You have to trust that they'll forgive us. It's hard to truly believe that, but... The photos in our album, they're not just photos, they're real memories. Our memories. It's proof of our friendship. Hold those pictures close, and remember what you want to protect. Haha, <laughs> I'm sorry. It looks like I'm burdening you again. The path to your future will open soon, but only you can decide what to do in the end. It's not much, but I'll be cheering you on. Sonny, let's make some new memories together, okay? Don't forget it's in the toy box. I was about to say, where does this key come into play? I've not used it yet. Is it in our room? Maybe it's in the music room. Maybe it's not. Sonny, it's almost time. You've been through a lot these past few days. You must be tired. We all make mistakes. You've been running from this one for a long time now. It's tough to own up to them sometimes, but you'll forgive yourself, won't you? You can do this, Sonny. You've worked really hard to get to this point. There's only one thing left to do now. Know that I'll always be watching over you, okay? As long as you remember me, I'll be here. Don't see a toy box in there. Not in here, actually. What the hell's the toy box? I mean, that's my parents' room. That's the bathroom. Is it in here? Nope. Maybe. Probably. Yes. We've never been allowed in this room. There's the light.
the violin. Oh, that's what it was on the floor. She broke the violin. That's what the fight was. It was the violin. You got a violin. Strands of long black hair entangled within its strings. You got sheet music. The paper is torn and wrinkled by blood. But it can still be read. A grand piano. The word Amori is etched across the centre. I think we confess. If that's the two endings we've got from for us now. This was unexpected. Okay, we're just going to beamed up in a UFO, I guess. Yes, I just got what I needed. Uh-oh, my hand doesn't look so good. You can't just tell people that, Kel. You have to keep a good poker face. Ah, when did you get behind me, Mari? I just got here, silly. Here, I brought cookies for everyone. The full health item. Basil, are you taking a photo? Uh-oh, uh, yeah. Hehe. <laughs> oh man. Don't take a photo when I'm struggling like this. Oh, don't be so dramatic, Kel. It's just a card game. Hehehe. <laughs> huh? Another photo? And what's so funny anyway? Is there something you're not telling us, Basil? Don't worry about it. You'll find out soon enough. Mari's cookies are the best, huh, Sonny? Oh, hero. Don't be so humble. You know your cookies are way better than mine. Hey, that's subjective. Mario's cookies... Mario's cookies have much more love baked into them. I could eat them forever. Oh, stop it, hero. You're embarrassing me. Are you sure you want to go? I feel like I'm missing something. Is it the anime mask? No. You look at Basil's hand. It's a jack and an ace. Shh. Don't tell anyone, okay? I mean, I don't know what game you're playing, like. I presume you're playing, yeah. Uh, Blackjack? Well, that might be the poker quest me kicking in. You look at Aubrey's hand. It's a 2, a 5, and a 10. Hmm. What do you think, Sonny? What should I do? Decisions, decisions. You look at Kel's hand. It's a 4, a 6, and a 6. Don't, don't look, Sonny. It's... It's too horrible. Ah, uh, I'm gonna lose, aren't I? You'll get Hero's hand. It's a king, a queen, and an ace. Hee 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 Talk about luck, huh, Sonny? It's so nice to spend our last days of summer here. We just do this every year. Here, have a cookie. You got Mari's cookie? They was perfectly crisp on the outside and sweet and gooey on the inside. You know what? That's just how I like them. Let's go. You remembered the smell of freshly baked cookies. It smelled better knowing that Mari made it from scratch. The violin mended a part of itself. See the game loop here. Let's so say we're at the beach, we're at the beach. And there! The watermelon's all cut up. Come on everyone, take a slice. Yay, thank you, hero. Look at you, such a big, strong man. 
Ha! Oh, not now, Mari. <laughs> Woohoo! Nothing beats a nice, juicy watermelon on a hot summer's day. Munch, 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 munch. 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 Hey, don't take a picture of me while I'm eating, Basil. Ha! <laughs> I'm sorry, Aubrey. I just thought you looked cute. I'll show you when it's ready. Well, okay, fine. I trust you, Basil. Hey, Sonny, you want to see the photo of Aubrey? Aubrey's so cute, isn't she? Ugh, gross. Stop spitting seeds on me, Cal. <laughs> you have seeds all over your face. Well, how about this then? Ooh, stop it, Aubrey. You'll give me the cuties. Let me play, hero. They're just teasing each other. Oh, let them play, sorry. Remember how we were when we were younger? I used to hide bugs in your desk all the time just to see your reaction. You're always so funny. Well, wait, that was you? Uh, whoops. Am I in trouble now, hero? <laughs> Guys, come on, we're at the beach. We're supposed to be relaxing. <laughs> Ooh, gross. Stop spitting seeds on me, Cal. Haha, <laughs> you have seeds all over your face. Okay, it's the same thing again. They just have the same conversation line. Alright. You sure you want to go? Yep. Are we going to the picnic now? Do you remember the taste of watermelon? It tasted more delicious when you ate it with everyone in the hot summer. The violin mended a part of itself. Okay, more light bulbs. Turning on. There we go. Picnic? Hmm. It looks like everyone fell asleep. I guess it's just the, us three now. Everyone must be feeling sleepy after such a big meal. Thank you for cooking for all of us, hero. Ah, oh, it was nothing. I'm just practicing a little. I'm glad you all liked it. One day, you're going to be a world famous chef and you're going to cook me lots of yummy food. Huh? Wait. I am? Of course you are. I believe in you, hero. Well, if you say so. I'm glad you're using your camera more now, Basil. You seem to be enjoying your new hobby. Yeah. I guess it's pretty fun once you get the hang of it. Wait a sec. There's something strange in this photo. Hector! How could you? Hey Sonny, I took a photo of everyone earlier. Want to see it? Yeah, I predict this. This could have been such a good shot, but Hector had to ruin the photo with his poop. Uh, maybe I can cover it with a tape later. I don't even see it. Oh, I see it. I even see it on the map now. <laughs> oh hey, little brother. Sorry, did we wake you up? You look so peaceful sleeping there. Reminds me when you were just a baby. Hey Sonny, can I poke your brain for a minute? I really love cooking and all, and Mari always says I'm really good, but my parents want me to become a doctor. You think I should become a chef? Yeah. Ha ha ha, maybe. 
We're still young. We should dream big, right? Exactly, hero. Hmm. But yeah. My mum's going to have something to say about that. Eh. Uh, let me escape, please. You remember the feeling of sleeping in Mari's lap. It felt more comfortable because you knew that, no matter what, Mari would always keep you safe. The violin mended a part of itself. I don't remember the last photo. Is it going to be the living room now? Was it a birth in the living room? I'm a bit worried we're going to get to the photo of us at the top of the stairs. But I think we still have a birthday party. I'm expecting it to be on this side as well. Don't debate me, thank you. Oh. Neither. Hey, Sonny. Hey, Basil. What took you guys so long? Sorry, we got carried away playing this new game where you fight each other with these things called pet rocks. I forgot all about the pet rock. I'm so sorry. Basil, Basil, take a picture of my new raincoat. Oh, okay. One sec. I didn't even remember this photo. Do you like it, Sonny? It's my favourite colour. Pink. Ooh, pink is a gross colour. No, it's not. Kel, you're a gross colour. That doesn't even make any sense. Oh, Sonny, that reminds me. Mari and I were talking about dyeing our hair together. Mari says she's going to dye her hair purple. P -p -p purple You want to know what colour I chose? Pink. Wait. Are you saying you're going to want to dye your hair pink? Ooh, that's weird. Why would you ever do that? I don't know. I just thought it would look cute. Mari thinks so too. Hmm. I'll never understand you two and your crazy ideas. I think pink would look good on you, Aubrey. What do you think, Sonny? It would do. Sonny says that he thinks pink is a great colour. See? Even Basil and Sonny agree. You're the only one who's weird, Cal. Psh. Whatever. What is it, Sonny? Do you want to see the photo? Yep. Yeah. Oh, I remember this one now. He always asks to look at my photo whenever I take any pictures of Aubrey. Do I, maybe, sense a little crush? You feel your ears turning red. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't say anything. My lips are sealed. Yay, that settles it. One day I'm going to dye my hair pink. But, maybe not anytime soon. My dad is kind of strict about these things. You said you and Basil were playing that new Pet Rocks game? Hmm. Maybe I should get into it too. Hey, I know. Why don't we go to Hobbies to check out if they have any new stuff? Oh, you're going to go on ahead, it's Sonny? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. Let's leave. Okay, birthday party treehouse next. Or the living room, was it? I think it was in the living room, wasn't it, the birthday party? Violin mended a part of itself. I didn't read the rest, sorry. The rain probably reminded us of something. Are you sure you don't want to be in the photo, Sonny? Sonny's a bit camera shy. We all have those days, don't we? It's okay, Sonny. You'll get used to it soon enough. <laughs> wow, this cake looks amazing. You've really outdone yourself this time, Hero. Yay, thanks, Hero. I love strawberries. Basil, Basil, what wish are you going to make? Hey, you can't ask that, Aubrey. Or else, it won't come true. Huh? Is that how it works? 
then in that case, I wish that Kel would get a straight A in school. Hey, you can't do that. Hmm, a wish. Ah, but what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. Oh, I know. <laughs> I think I'll wish for... Just kidding. It's a secret. Aw, I want to know though. Guys, if we don't hurry, the candles are going to melt. Are we all ready to sing? Yeah, you bet. Did you want to start us off, Maori? Sure thing. Ahem. And a one, and a two, and a three, four. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Basil. Happy birthday to you. Woohoo! Blow out the candles, Basil. Make a wish. You remembered. Basil smiled as he was about to blow out his birthday candles. But you also remembered. As Basil made his wish, you made one too. At that time, you wished for everyone to be happy. The violin mended a part of itself. Well, I can't help but think now we're going back to the top of the stairs. Wow, a new basketball? Thanks, bro. No problem, Cal. You can thank me by doing a little better in school. Uh-uh, you bet. Okay, Sonny. It's time for you to open your present. Alright, there's more photos. This year, you just get one present. From all of us. It probably doesn't look like much, but we all had to save up for it together. Yeah, me and Basil even started selling cookies and lemonade in the summer. Amara and I took a job at the bakery for a while, if you remember. And me? I had to deliver newspapers every morning for like three months. And you know how much I hate mornings. We know this might be a lot of pressure, but... It's been a while since you quit playing the violin. Mari told us about how you always sit in the room with her when she's practicing the piano. And there was even that one time I caught you trying to play your old mini violin, even though it's a little bit too small for you. Anyway, this was Basil's idea. I wonder what this mystery present's going to be, shaped like a violin. But we all decided to pitch in for a really nice one. So, yeah. We hope you like it, Sonny. This is from all of us, to you. Ta-da! It's your very own violin. We hope you like it, Sonny. Go on and try it out. You felt a tingling in your fingers, as if on its own. Your body readied the violin to play. Remembered the anxious feeling in your heart as you played the first note on your new violin. That it scared you, but you didn't mind. Because they believed in you. And no matter what, you didn't want to disappoint them. Because they were your friends. 
the violin regained its shape. You remembered the smell ship. Okay. So this is just a reminder of everything that went on. The recital. Sonny, you're finally here. After this point, it's going to be up to you. You know, before we met, I had a lot of trouble fitting in. Even after we all became friends, I always assumed you were going to leave me eventually. But, when the others were busy doing things, you always seemed to have time for me. You would listen to me talk for hours and hours. I could always rely on you to do that. I know we've missed out on each other for the past few years, but it doesn't have to stay that way. People always tell me that I'm dense or that I'm kind of careless, but I'll always be here if you're okay with that. Sonny, we know that you're not someone who likes to take the lead. This has been really hard for you, but you have to put a little bit of trust into us too. Just because you've done something bad, doesn't make you bad. You've had to live with this pain for so long and you've been keeping it all inside. It might be easy to ignore your problems but it's okay to cry about them too. There's more good times to come. Life gets better and you can be the one to make that happen. Oh, they've animorphed into their present day versions. Whatever happens next is going to be your call. But we're here for you because you want us to be. And we really hope that this isn't goodbye. Mari's picnic basket. Would you like to save? <sighs> Feels like a good a time as any. Uh, and could have put a very confusing series of saves just in case to come back to this. We believe in you, Sonny. An empty music stand. Do you want to place down your sheet music? Place the sheet music onto the music stand. The stage is ready for you. Do you want to play the violin? thought it'd be this music.
Oh. Hey, Maury. Not expected. Sunny versus Amori. Heal your wounds and come back stronger. Your juice will not fall for three turns. Attack three times. Eh. I think we actually have to defeat them. We have to defeat, like, our alter self. Well, probably should have encored first. Well, <laughs> I made a bit of a misplay there. Ow. That was a crit. We'll cherish. Will this heal my juice, do you think? You remember Kel's words. Friends. Friends are supposed to be there for each other. Yes, we do get it back. Take this, Amori. Again. Goodbye, Amori. Amori did not succumb. Excuse me. We shall cherish, maybe? Hmm. We'll, we'll cherish. Sonny steadies his breathing. You remembered Aubrey's wish. I hope you can find some peace. Or, you know, some happiness. Amoria raises the enemy. You're just critting it all the time now. We strike three times. You've caused so much suffering, yet you do nothing. And so you've earned nothing in return. Uh, just do a normal attack here. Your friends will never forgive you. They'll abandon you like they did then. And that's what you deserve. No, Amori. We have to confront our past. We have to overcome it. Amori did not succumb. We'll do a little cherish here. You remembered Hera's promise. Last time, we made the mistake of leaving each other when we needed each other the most. This time, we'll stay together. You tell yourself that you don't want to burden others. But the truth is that you're selfish. You just don't want other people to depend on you. Oh, our defense fell. We took 100 damage there, by the way. We take 31 damage. Okay, we get splashing. When do you think about others? How long are you going to let people take care of you? You say you care, but you're a liar. You've never done anything for everyone else. You're useless. Less than useless. You're sick. 
Let's throw another attack in. I think we can deal with this. And then I might calm down next time. Just to not risking Wombo comboed by Amori. People like you don't deserve to live. Okay, I'm going to calm down. We recover 150 health. Oh, I thought you were going to do this attack again. People like you don't deserve to live. Okay. People like you don't deserve to live. Amori did not succumb. Let's cherish. Sonny steadies his breathing. You remember Basil's hope? Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Your friends are wrong about you. The person they love isn't you at all. You let them believe in a lie to protect yourself. Holy meatballs, Captain, they're doing the damage. We'll do an encore. Ugh. They lift me on seven. You're nothing but a liar. And when they see the truth, they'll hate you as much as you hate yourself. Uh, can I please cherish again? Nope, I have to calm down. If they know the truth, you'll never be able to regain their trust. No matter what you do, it will be hopeless. All you'll do is make things worse. It would be better to just die. Keep calming down. Overcome, Sonny. It would be better if you just die. Uh, I, I just can't find a little, you know, window at the moment to attack. Like, are we supposed to die here? Because my stats are going through the, the floor. It'd be better if you just die. You know what? Risk it for a biscuit. Maybe we won't overcome. Yeah, it'd be better if we just die. I know. I know the drill by now. Calm down. Okay, we took 53 damage. Just doing a normal attack. We'll we'll heal next time. Not run. We're gonna defeat Amori. This could be the big erase attack. Yes. So I think we have to heal off the erase attack. Because otherwise we're gonna die. Now you're gonna stab me, I think. Nope, you're erasing me again. Is this gonna kill me eventually? Because it's lowering my defense every time, right? So surely it's steadily doing more and more damage to me. Okay, he didn't erase me this time, so I think we go for an attack here. And now we calm down again. You gonna erase me again? No. So I think I take this opportunity to attack again. Have we got you? Will you succumb? They will not succumb. Right. 
We're going to calm down first and see what you do. You killed Mari. She loved you and you killed her. Uh, we're now afraid. So I think we should calm down here. Try and remove afraid. Again, I'm going to try and remove afraid. Hero loved her and you killed her. Just keep calming down. I don't think I can use my other abilities while I'm afraid. Just keep going. Aubrey loved her and you killed her. There we go. Hell loved her and you killed her. Okay. Give me a, a cherish? No, give me an attack. I want the cherish to get more value than that. Basil loved her and you killed her. You loved her and you killed her. Okay, I think now we cherish. Yeah, we loved her and we killed her. Suddenly so steadies his breathing. You remembered Mari's request. You'll forgive yourself, won't you, Sonny? You loved her and you killed her. We're gonna encore on Allegria, or whatever it was called, Allegri. Not a musician, I don't remember what it is. Of course. I can't be afraid. Okay, we'll calm down. We can still get it off. Okay, we get it off now. Oh, did we... Did we fail the calm down? Or did I just not do it? Maybe I attacked by accident. Holy moly, we can't do it anymore. Okay, just attack. They're still not succumbing. Please calm down. Not letting me calm down anymore. You should just die. Well. Do we not succumb? Sonny was defeated. Game over? Do you want to continue? Yes. Because I don't think I could have won that. I couldn't use any skills. I think you're playing with gameplay mechanics now. We will overcome. play.
Okay, we're still going. I thought that was leading into the end of the game. So we're in a hospital? Is this because we had a fight with Basil, you think? The door is locked. Okay. I'm going to presume all the doors are locked. Where do I go? So the stranger was Basil? And then the other three my friends? We go to Basil. I mean Basil is my friend. We see how he's doing. Did we save him? Save him from the guilt? His isolation? We don't chase the past, we look forward to the future. I have something to tell you. One more day, the sun reaches my bed. You can do the rest of the songs. What a fantastic game. Like, honestly, I was gripped at the end. I couldn't stop playing as you can tell by the episode length. I just had to see it out now. I, I honestly am speechless. It was a wonderful game at moments you know I just couldn't see where it was going and as it unraveled and like we realised you know that I did actually call it early on that uh, Amori or Sonny sorry had killed Mari and I thought no maybe Mari just committed suicide but no we, we faked it and that's you know what was going on Basil knew it happened and he was hiding it and he became isolated because of it and it was like eating away at him we became basically a recluse. And I think at the end, we had a fight with Basil because it was like, it just, the emotions, you know, just went over the brim. And that's why we're in the hospital now. I think it gave me the choice to either like, you know, stay in the past or move forwards. And we told everyone about what happened. The, like the turns in this game have been like, so bizarre. I mean, and I mean this in a good way. I know it doesn't sound good when I say bizarre, but like the RPG elements were like a good enough game in itself. And like this last hour or something, we've not had basically any of this RPG element game. And I've still been gripped by it. I don't think I've ever played a game like this before. It was fantastic. Achievement unlocked one more day. Thanks for playing. You know what? Thanks for making the game. It was an incredible experience. Saddening at times and it did like upset me in places. But how are you going to tell this story otherwise? And it's changed the title screen again. Incredible. Honestly, normally I would chase some extra stuff after the, you know, the game's done. Maybe try and like, you know, see all the jokes and stuff. Try and figure out what those faces were in the walls, which I never figured out. But I think this was an appropriate place to end it. If people have a clamoring for it, then tell me in the comments below and maybe I will chase some of like the additional content, like some of the side quests. Sorry, kind of like, I felt like I straight lined it towards the end, but... I was gripped, as I said. It was a, a fantastic experience, like 10 out of 10 game. This, if it came out this year, would have been my game of the year, but I will, I will, you know, what's the word for it? Retrospectively, I will retrospectively give you my 2020 game of the year because you were fantastic. And that'll do you, 
well, that'll do us for this series, I guess, sorry. Let me know in the comments what you felt about the story. Let me know if, by the way, there were other endings and stuff, because I, I don't know. I presume if we went the other way, we would have got a different ending where we didn't tell anyone. And, you know, things just steadily ate us up inside. But bam, what a great game. Thanks a lot for everyone for watching it, and I'll see you in a new series. Goodbye.